You're working for Riddler. Hey, what? You're crazy! Batman's gone crazy, guys! What are you doing, Batman? Back off! Stand down, Batman! I don't know what he's talking about, guys! Are you sure? Okay, okay! I do favors for Nygma! Tell him when Gordon's on his trail, stick those dumb trophies of his around the place, that kind of stuff. But that's it, really. I'm not such a bad guy, I swear. I don't care. Hey, you can't throw me in here, I'm a cop! Not anymore. Joining your mission can come with a cost. This empty reminder shows just what she lost. Lost. Joining your mission can come with a cost. This empty reminder shows just what she lost. Detective? <laughs> Craving a grimly satisfying reminder of your own stupidity? <laughs> then test your mind against the brand new riddles in Stag's Airship, the malicious hideout, and the abandoned film studios. Stag's Airship, the malicious hideout, and the abandoned film studios. There are riddles to be solved on Miyagani Island, Batman. It is named for the tribe who lived in Gotham in pre-colonial times. Colonial. They worship the Batman. Worship. This chip will let me mimic Riddler's signals and give commands to his robots.
You're here. You're here. Lately, Batman, I've been pondering the value of human life Brilliant. and your strange insistence upon preserving even its basest forms. Preserve Take the barely literate triple murderer in the nearby riot. He's a dead man come dawn. When the microbomb I surreptitiously placed in his brain explodes. My hypothesis is simple. When faced with the task of trying to save one condemned man amongst that gaggle of idiots, even you will give up in despair. Oh, and don't knock him out. What little brain activity he has, keep that cranial combustible from detonating. Combustible detonating. I need to use the remote batarang to scan the nearby crowd for Riddler's victim. There he is. If I can electrically charge the remote batarang, I'll be able to deliver a shock to Riddler's bomb. Congratulations, hero! You saved a murderer, a monster, a moron! The Gene Pool thanks you for your efforts. There's more doomed men in Gotham tonight. You won't prove your obnoxiously principled point until you save them all. Until, until, until you save them all. Hide up there all you like, Batman!
Where does this newsman conduct his research? Research. Research. A souvenir from a previous life. Why hold with a hand when a hook will suffice?
identified a key flaw in your car's design. The driver. should receive top billing.
thought it best we meet alone, Edward. I know what you're doing, Crane. Talking to me away from Cobblepot and the others. You're appealing to my ego. Is it working? Ha! I don't have an ego, Crane. I'm far too brilliant. Especially for the likes of you. Of course, Edward. But nonetheless, we have a mutual foe. A foe I could vanquish with but one of my cerebral lobes intact. Yet, here you are, proposing an alliance that would let you bask in my luminescent glory. But what if you failed, Edward? What if, by some underhand means, of course, the Batman were to humiliate you again? Absurd! I know, Edward, it's a frightening thought. How many failures can even your enviable reputation withstand? But... If the bat were distracted and tugged in too many directions by too many threats, why, then you would be assured of the upper hand. I, uh, I don't know how to respond to your ridiculous insinuations, so all I will say is this. Tell me which day you plan to attack Gotham, and maybe, just maybe, if you're lucky, I will coincidentally put my entirely separate and superior master plan into effect. How kind, Edward. I will keep my fingers crossed.
You remember how this works, Dark Knight. Somewhere in the nearby riot is a criminal unwittingly carrying a bomb in his brain. He's really not worth saving, so don't. Not until you save them all. Save them, them, them all. An open house for bed and dinner. dinner. Is this sanctuary run by saint or sinner? Or sinner. <laughs>
he spent on this army, and I'd kill the bat in two seconds. Tries blowing us all to pieces again. We got a mortgage to pay off.
ain't too late to join up, my friend. Penguin's always looking for new recruits. I hear the money's good, too. of conversing with me, the Riddler, Gotham's premier supervillain and intellectual colossus. And I'm honored, Eddie. Really? Bye. Wait, wait. I'll get to the point. I find myself in need of your unique skill set, your street smart, as your intellectually challenged kind adorably calls them. I'm going to adorably hang up on you, Eddie. No, no, no. Listen. I need something acquired. Something valuable. Sorry, Eddie. It's just that I have all these clients who aren't insecure little power-mad man-children. <sighs> Fine. You may name your fee. Information. Ah, the most valuable commodity of all. Scarecrow's planning something involving Batman. I might be furnished with the absurd particulars of his ridiculous scheme. <laughs> I'll get you what you want, Eddie, if you tell me what I need to know. Careful, the bat's got a cannon on it! 
yourselves. caused a fright.
is gone, Batman still ain't one to fight. of my riddles. Congratulations! Unfortunately, you've now reached what I call the stupidity threshold. In, in, in layman's terms, my little layman, they were the easy ones. Easy ones. Easy ones. Easy ones. Batman, that the nearby rioter I've rigged to blow has been jailed four times? For murder? Yes, 
murder most foul. Why, leaving his skull to erupt in a bloody shower of cerebral confetti would actually be justice now, wouldn't it? Wouldn't it? Wouldn't it? Wouldn't it? I need to use the remote batarang to and the nearby crowd for Riddler's victim. There's Riddler's victim. His next victim will write you a thank you letter. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I bet you weren't invited to this lavish do. I wonder how many went dressed up as you.
me, but the hypothetical time in which I would naturally complete the course. Algorithms uploaded, joints oiled. Now, <clears throat> give my creation life! Ah, damn it! Useless hunk of dead metal. Do you want to become a semi automated theme park mannequin? Because that's the fate in store for you. Problem, Eddie? Ah, Miss Kyle. <laughs> You're here. And you already have company. Almost, anyway. Did you lose your friend's battery? Why, you. Yes. <laughs> In a manner of speaking, anyway, I'm depleted. And always compensating for it, too. <laughs> oh, Catwoman, your wit never ceases to occur. Now, I need you to procure a set of rechargeable energy cells for me. Stag Enterprises' Nimbus Tech will work. I'm sure Wayne Enterprises has an equivalent. Got it. It's been a pleasure, as always, Eddie. Except for the talking to you part. Wait! At least take a glimpse at what it is you're supposed to be stealing. There, in the robot's chest cavity. Go on, it won't bite. Eddie, there's no... <laughs> What the hell? Eddie, make this thing let me go. Batteries? You think I needed batteries? Oh, Miss Kyle, you underestimated my bespoke power supply innovations, and that was your downfall. What is this, Eddie? This is... you are... Bait. You see, I've identified what I believe to be some sort of attachment between you and Batman. The base nature of this attachment, quite frankly, disgusts me. But it will bring him here. You'll regret this! <laughs> the world's greatest detective does not frighten me! He's not the reason you'll regret it. 